Koreans are active crypto traders with local exchanges outperforming global rivals in volume and a strong preference towards altcoins and local tokens, according to a report from Dspread Research. The number of crypto investors in the country reached about 6 million or 10% of the population this year, according to a Korean Financial Intelligence Unit survey. The majority of these investors are primarily engaged in investment activities centered around centralized exchanges, making the influence of centralized exchanges in the Korean crypto market significant. Since March, centralized exchanges worldwide have seen declines in trading volumes as Bitcoin traded sideways. Local exchanges such as Upbit outpaced market leader Binance by July, partly due to a surge in XRP's price and trading volume after a favorable ruling in Ripple's court case against the Securities and Exchange Commission. The trading volume of the four major Korean exchanges increased to $37 billion in July, a 37% increase from the previous month. Korean traders are big into altcoins and not so fond of major tokens, with the majority of individual investors on Upbit showing strong interest in altcoins with high profit potential and accepting associated high risk. The Chicago Mercantile Exchange has risen to the second largest Bitcoin futures exchange with a notional open interest of $3.54 billion, a move reminiscent of the early stages of the 2020-2021 bull run. The top shot is held by offshore unregulated exchange Binance with an open interest of $3.83 billion, 8% higher than CME. CME's cash settled futures contracts recently surpassed the 100,000 BTC mark for the first time on record, and its share in the BTC futures market rose to a new lifetime high of 25%. CME's standard Bitcoin futures contract is equivalent to 5 BTC, while its micro contract is sized at one tenth of 1 BTC. Most open interest in offshore exchange is contracted in perpetual futures, which use the funding rate mechanism to keep perpetuals in sync with the spot price. Bitcoin whales have been buying over 30,000 BTC worth around $1 billion in the last five days, according to Ali, a crypto analyst. The Bitcoin spot ETF applications have boosted the appetite for Bitcoin among whales and institutions. Institutional activity is increased for the largest cryptocurrency by market capitalization as the number of transactions worth more than $100,000 on the Bitcoin blockchain search reaches a new peak in 2023. Large transactions or those over $100,000 sold in late June following BlackRock's ETF application have now surpassed that threshold as Bitcoin achieves new yearly highs. BTC has risen approximately 14.44% in the last seven days, recently settling at around $34,253. Short-term activity is also heating up, but the Bitcoin market value to realized value ratio indicates that Bitcoin is not yet as overheated as it was during prior bull markets. In the upcoming segment, we will update you about the following news. Hashtags engages in dialogue with SEC over Bitcoin DeFi ETF filing. Dollar Yen trading Volume surpasses Bitcoin on DeFi platform gains network. Neo sets sites on DeFi unveils EVM compatible side trades. Stay tuned for more updates.